the Crestview volleyball team found themselves in the state semifinals a little over a year ago, only to be sent home after falling to New Bremen. Getting back to that stage sits as the Lady Knights top priority in 2023. I think we all have come in this season with a mindset that we want to get back and that we need to get back because not only did we enjoy it a lot, but I know our community enjoyed it as well. Etzler recognizes that this team's success does more than just give them a shot at some hardware. Set a good example for the future girls that come up to this team, but not to put pressure on them, but at the same time, like, continue what we started. So hopefully we don't take 30 more years to get back. Preparing for the future means younger girls looking up to Etzler and her teammates as role models. While Etzler takes pride in that, she hopes the next generation finds comfort in embracing those they look up to. I don't want them to look at me differently than they would their classmate. I would, I would love for like younger g girls to come talk to me, ask me for advice, but I don't really get much of that, but I would love if that happened. Etzler's skill set and leadership allowed her to commit to Ashland University to play college ball, a decision that runs in the family. My parents both went there, so I know that they, they loved it and they told me such good things about it. And also my brother will be there for a year with me, which will be nice because they'll have a little bit of home with me. But I also love the coaching staff. They felt like home when I went there to visit them. And I also got a chance to play with the girls at an open gym and I just really felt comfortable and at home there. While the choice of university runs in the family, Etzler knows her sport of choice does not, coming from a long line of basketball players. My parents, my grandpa, my uncle, and both my brothers all played college basketball, so I guess I just changed it up a little bit with volleyball. As Crestview continues to show they have what it takes to compete for a state title, Etzler believes the only team that can get in their way is themselves. Well, I definitely noticed during the summer scrimmages that we started off a lot stronger than we did last year. I know we only lost one senior. I mean, she was a big part of the team last year. She did a lot for us, but we also gained a really um, talented freshman. So I know we're just going to have to keep working as hard as we possibly can and like never let up because we know we have the confidence that we can be and are really good. It's just sometimes we might be a little cocky which some, sometimes that's good and sometimes we can't be too cocky because we still need to like know our place. So I guess we just really need to work really hard and come together as a team. In Convoy, Jack McGuire, WOSN.